Hey what's up guys Rajat here from World of VFX welcome back to another video today we talk about Unreal Engine newly launched MetaHuman 5.6 the most stable version and this will be a detailed video how you can create the characters and how you can create this live link with the face app so let's talk about this let's start the video and make sure if you are new in this channel subscribe right now so before moving further you need to go to epic games marketplace and go to library you need to download unreal engine 5.6 or if you have already beta version then you need to upgrade that or update then go to this option panel and you just check on this meta human code data which is 5.52 gb and once you download it launch unreal engine that's it all right this is unreal engine 5.6 the newly launched so first of all i'm just creating f1 so this was my last pose which you can see right now so let's start uh, i already created a video on this that was a beta version video but right now we launched the uh, stable version of unreal engine so let's dive into it so first of all i'm just pressing save all and let's go to new level and basic and let's press create so as you all know in meta human we need to turn on few settings right over here so first of all go to edit panel go to this plugins menu and you need to type called meta human and you can find all this option you need to check all these options on and make sure if you want to do the live link then make sure you need to turn this on as well whenever you turn this on all make sure you have to restart your unreal engine and this will take some time so once you restart your unreal engine first of all just go to right click you can find this called meta human and you can find this option called meta human character simply click and i'm just name it called tutorial and press enter double click and you will be in a different window this is called the meta human window so if you click the skin option you can actually see first time meta human with this new skin texture also you can use this clay modeling where you can exactly see the skin details and all which looks pretty perfect and as you all know in the last version the version was pretty not stable so you get a lot of crashes but right now this is a stable version so let's jump into the skin mode so this is the skin mode so right now we have the presets which already are done here as you can see in the previous version the beta version you can't see any presets so if you want to use anything from here you can really really use it so let's pick any one from here so i'm just click this old one so just double click it will initialize the character from the preset and it will automatically apply just like this so this looks pretty nice the skin details and the textures are also looking pretty amazing so yeah after that you can modify you can customize each and every parts of this character by the way if you find this video memory exhausted just hold on save your unreal engine and restart it it will fix trust me because this will take a lot of time to calculate all the textures and all so first of all click this body part and you can find these three options in the last version i told you if you have multiple body types you can exactly blend with this multiple body types so do the blending part simply just drag and drop and just drag few characters and just like this so now we have three characters and if you just click it you can see the hands are blending like this so this is three modes so you can blend between all these three hands so i'm just making it like this now this is a blending between a female to male character so let's blend with the other areas as well like thighs and all so if you notice the thighs are getting in a different modes and all and uh, let's go to the head part this is a very very fascinating part in this area so you have multiple heads as well which you can blend it to so simply drag and drop and drag this like this so now if you want to blend let's say if i want to blend the eyes so you can do this so bigger eyes you know uh bigger lips now it will become a lady character but if you want a completely default preset you can simply go to this preset panel and you can use it now coming to the hair and cloth part you can have lots of hair panels over here you can use anything so let's use this short pixie one just double click and it will automatically apply and this looks really nice it's looking uh, some korean movie characters are like this okay so if you have multiple uh, eyebrows also uh, eyelashes mustaches and all you can use it anything but i am just leaving this character like this only all right so once you're happy with your all the settings and all you need to create a full rig or you need to create only the facial rig so here i'm doing uh, first the texture download so if you want to take download the texture in 2k 4k 8k it's all up to you i'm just clicking the 4k resolution texture so it will take some time to download and apply it and trust me the downloading the uh, process is very very fast uh, they already created so much optimizations to download it and if you notice it's already done uh, after that we need to create this full rig this will take some time so just click this create full rig and it will start the rigging with the character for the entire body and the character rig is done if you just play you can see the character is uh, 
doing their work and this looks really nice the head movements the eye blinking things are absolutely perfect all right so now if you want to export this character to do your rest of the part so first thing first save it and go to file and make sure you have to press save all this is very very important so once you do this simply go to this assemble panel and if you want to export this to any other softwares like unreal and all then you can use this ue optimized or you can use the dcc export but here i'm just using inside of unreal engine so i'm just click this one and this will be a location where the exported character you can use it and this is the file name and then you can click this assemble panels and uh, one more thing once you click this assemble panel maybe your unreal engine can be crashed so that's why i told you to previously that to save the file and right now i'm clicking this assemble and this will take some time so just hold on and it will fix and right now the character rigging is done assemble is done and you can see right now i've just turned on my iphone with this app called live link face app this is 100 percent free and once you open and make sure you have to click the settings button and you need to find this called wi-fi address make sure you have to connect your pc and the mobile with the same wi-fi address so make sure you have to select this wi-fi address and press done on your mobile screen and once you see this character rig on your face it will be tracking your face like this okay so right now what i'm going to do just save it and after that we have to close this file so just simply close it so this is the tutorial file which you have right now created and once you select this meta human you need to just turn on this blueprint class so you only find the final character inside of this blueprint class so just simply drag and drop the character and it will automatically fix and press f and this is the character which you have created right now so how you can uh, rig your facials with this like how you can connect your face with this uh, character so this is very easy so first of all you need to go to this window panel and virtual production live link and make sure your iphone should select it over here and the same ip address which you can see right now you need to just select and make sure connect so once you press and connect simply close this window and after that you can simply click the meta human character and make sure from here select your iphone and use live link and that's it you are good to go and if you notice the character is started talking as you are talking and right now if you notice the textures are missing this is just because of that to highly dense model so if you notice also there's called texture streaming pool it's over budget so what you can do you can restart your under engine and it will fix trust me and if you notice the movements head blinks everything looks perfect so if you watch here you can understand and um, yeah this looks superb so yes that's it for today i hope you really enjoyed this amazing video from this newly launched meta human 5.6 and if you yes then definitely subscribe right now my name is Rajesh. see you in my next video till then keep watching keep rocking world of vfx